Hi everyone, so this is my channel. My name's Raina, Rain, Ray, Reggie, whatever you want to call me. Um, so on this channel, I'm just going to talk about anything and everything. Um, but these few videos will be on my journey going vegan. So I'm a pescatarian. Um, I don't eat pork, I don't eat lamb, I don't eat turkey, um, and I don't eat beef. I'm allergic to beef, so I don't eat it anyway. Um, but I do eat chicken and, and I do eat some types of fish, but it's very rare. Um, so I eat very unhealthy, like I'll have chicken dippers, chicken dippers for like the whole day. I'll have chocolate for, for breakfast, whatever. And I literally just saw my health going down and depression was coming in, anxiety was coming in and everything. So I thought, okay, first of August, let me sort out my life. Um, I'm a graduate. So I thought, okay, I have nothing else to do um, except for work, um, and that's kind of it. So let me thought, I just thought, let me just start from now. And it's a month till my birthday, so I kind of thought, why not just start now? So um, I decided to just go vegan. Like my family made me watch this program called What the Health. It's on YouTube and it's on Netflix as well. So I do suggest everyone watch it just to give you like warning signs and everything. So I just watched that and okay, it literally just, you know, rang, brought everything together for me and just thought, okay, it's starting now. So I said from 1st of August, 1st September, so I'm trying it for a month and see what it's like and see what I feel like. Um, and honestly, after this first day, I literally felt even more energised and I was so happy with myself. Um, I, didn't, I didn't feel any kind of depression, anxiety, anything. So I thought, okay, this is going good. And I was going gym as well, so um, I thought, let's, let's just carry on and see where it goes. I can't like, it's kind of, it's kind of hard cooking wise, but other than that, it's going good, so. Um, I will post the video, not every day, but I will post like the days, like day one, day two, whatever, um, and see what goes on. My life is quite boring. Uh, I don't really do much. So <laughs> anything I do do, I will put it in the videos and everything to show you guys. If I go anywhere like a vegan restaurant or anything, I will show you guys. So here we go, this is day one. This is day one of my plant-based diet, so I'm, I'm not going to go like fully into it with plant-based, but um, what I'm going to start off with is like a smoothie that I drink every morning which has pineapple, mango, um, strawberry and spinach in it with like some water. Sometimes I'll change the strawberries for like bananas and I'll have that every morning. Um, so usually I'll have crackers or I'll have like um I usually have like a packet of bees but I'm trying to cut out milk um especially cow's milk now um I'm haven't really gotten into like almond milk or anything like that so I'm really gonna try and get into like different types of milk and stuff but um what I'm thinking this morning is so it's really you can't really get these in London but these are the Jacobs um, choice grains um they are suitable for vegetarians but um, usually it would probably be better if they're not multi-grain but whole grain but like Ravita are whole grain um, crackers but these are multi-grain but I'm going to go ease into it really slowly plus I want to finish this off um, so I'm just going to eat that with um, butter today so my breakfast is just um, a smoothie and four crackers with butter so that's what I'm going to eat today in the morning and then I'll record my lunch my snack and my dinner later here we go cracker hummus and organic hummus mm. ingredients cooked organic chickpeas organic grapeseed oil and water it looks alright. So I think I might just get this one. Suitable for vegetarians. So I might just get that one. 
what about like this one? Let's see what's got two peas, grapes and oil, water, also lemon juice, salt, garlic puree, preservative, protein. Also, see it for the um, vegetarians. You know what? I'm gonna go with the organic just because I'm just gonna go with this one, I think. I wanted an alternative to butter, like for a spread on my like my crackers and my toast or something so what i think i'm going to try is smooth cashew butter i have like almond butter but in reality i don't actually like almonds so i think i'm going to try cashew butter because i really love cashews Try and crackers comforts as to shakes cakes and bakes part of a very balanced diet and healthy lifestyle Suitable vegetables. Ooh, vegans. Ooh. Let's try this then. So I found um, whole meal pita bread for 50p. Um, it also says suitable for vegetarians. So I'm just going to try this one and see. Um, I'm really craving nachos. I know I shouldn't, but let's see what they have. Do they, do they even have like nachos here? Yeah. Nacho chips. So I'm just on my way to my friend's house and I'll just walk in there. Usually I would drive there but trying to live the healthy lifestyle and not drive. She literally lives like five minutes around the corner. So I thought, let me just walk here. But overall, I spent £8.37 on a tub of hummus, um, a whole grain pizza bread, nacho, a packet of nachos, um, dubito salsa dip, um, and a bottle of water, and and cashew butter which is me to try tomorrow morning with my crackers for breakfast and my smoothie um, so this is my lunch I forgot that I bought grapes so. yeah I know you always like right behind me <laughs> you like okay so we just finished our gym sesh um, and then we went to um, Sainsbury's to buy like my dinner stuff. Um, so I bought vermicelli noodles. No, it's vermicelli. If it's vermicelli or vermicelli, let me know. Um, vermicelli. No, it's che so we just got back from the gym. Um, we went to Sainsbury's, as you said, to get some dinner. Um, wow. Um, it is quite late, but I really need to eat. So I bought. Don't put too much on. I'm fine. Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah. <laughs> um, so I bought vermicelli pasta. Apparently, it's vermicelli, vermicelli, vermicelli um, noodles with some mushrooms, red pepper. Um, mixed fruit, onion, and we've got mixed vegetables with some sweet chili and garlic stir fry sauce. And it says suitable for vegans and it's medium heat, so I'm, I'm hoping it doesn't burn my mouth, but oh well. Um, and yeah, so we're just going to cook that and I'm going to show how we're doing it. So at the moment, we're just boiling the noodles. 
getting the pans ready for the stir fry. Dee's cooking up, chopping them, peppers, and then yeah, we'll just show you what we do step by step. Yeah. Check it. Yeah. Check it. So we're just gonna start from this, and then we'll take you like step by step. Well, not step by step. We're just gonna show you like what we're doing and stuff. What's gonna be funny when you watch this back? I know. Okay, so in this frying pan right now, um, I've got onion, mixed veg, um, and I don't like broccoli, so I kind of had to shift some of it over to D side, because I really do not like broccoli. Um, I'm filming with my right and kind of shifting it all with my left, so it's quite hard. So D had to kind of help me as well. Um, so next, what we're going to do is just add the noodles um, into that as well. Um, and pour the sweet chilli and garlic sauce in that as well um, and just mix everything all together. I added mushroom to mine because I wanted a bit of, um, you know, a meat replacement so I kind of added mushroom to mine. That's why we did it separate because Doyen doesn't like mushroom but I love mushrooms so um, that's what's the difference, that's why we did it in different pans. Um, so we added the sauce and just mixed everything together and it tasted so good um, and I, even the next day it tasted even better so yeah so thanks for watching guys um, please give this a thumbs up if you did like it and you want to see more of my journey um, and also don't forget to subscribe share and um, stay tuned for day two, day three, and the rest of the day.